Beautiful. Boy, they were born two minutes apart. They've been close all their lives, even academically. Our John Thomas has the amazing story of twins who reached for the top and got there. I'm ready to be relieved. For ROTC Commander Dalton Settlemeyer, relinquishing command signals an end to an exceptional high school career that saw him star in track and football while being named homecoming king. And now, as he says his final goodbye to Dunedin High School, he will say that as valedictorian. But that is not the whole story. I was just being a southern gentleman, letting the lady go first. Meet Dalton's older sister by two minutes, Lindsay. Lindsay stood out at Dunedin High School as well as a cheerleader, and she leaves saying goodbye as salutatorian. When she sets out to do something, she does it not only, you know, to the best of her ability, but it, I mean, it's, it's just, it blows my mind and it's perfect. Yes, Lindsay and Dalton have finished number one and number two in their class. The only difference, a world history class back in sophomore year, where Dalton got an A and Lindsay got a B. It's always been friendly competition. It's only to improve each other. And where are these kids who have only ever spent a week apart heading to say hello to their future? Lindsay, Florida Southern, and Dalton, the University of Florida. I'm definitely going to want to talk to him a lot just because he's the rock I can go to to always relate to. Now, hearing them speak of each other, that should tip you off. That even though they may have technically finished one and two in each other's eyes, they will always be number one. Are you great, kids? We are. I well, I mean, I, in our own estimation, I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I'm, but uh, I yeah. can vouch. She's a great kid. She's a great kid. <laughs>